hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'll be doing an unboxing and a quick review as well as some solar testing on the go labs a 100 watt portable solar 12 volt panel right after this if you are new to my channel and would like to stay up to date with the latest tips and tricks for amazon fire devices and product reviews then go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click on the bell icon for future notifications thank you so much all right guys so in today's video um, i would like to thank go labs very much for sending me this portable folding 100 watt 12 volt solar panel which is awesome but before i go ahead and get started this is what the solar panel looks like when it's folded and let me go ahead and actually twist this around let me show you what's inside the i guess the, you can call this the glove compartment What's really nice, uh, what I would like to start with is that what's really nice about the solar panel is that it has permanent MC4, oops, permanent MC4 um, solar cables that are built in. Here's the male and the female, a positive and negative as well. Um, so, and then on the junction box, you can see that on the left hand side, you have a DC input. You have a micro USB input, which is very nice. And then you also have two separate USB-A uh, charging ports as well so you can charge your phone your tablet and of course through usb usb c as well and also the dc port and i'm, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you as well right now what kind of accessories you get here so let's go ahead and start with the uh, go labs user manual this is a very straightforward uh, user manual it's just, it's just telling you the basics of how to use the solar panel what to plug it into and whatnot so it's about five or six pages then what's really nice i really appreciate this from go labs that you can get that, that this is actually included with the solar panel you get 10 different adapters for different power stations and whatnot and this is a really nice option to be honest so, so that way you're not you're not only charging uh, their power station but you can also charge multiple other devices at the same time and the way this works is let me show you this other piece uh, that this other accessory that you also get with it you get about maybe this is about four or five foot extension cord this is what they call an anderson uh charging cable on one end and on the other end is an actual dc port i'm not sure if this is a dc 5521 or dc 5525 it's one of them but as you guys can see maybe you can correct me in the video if i'm wrong about that and then you also get a another extension cable now this one is you can actually on on one end this is this looks like looks like uh, this one looks like about four or five feet long and it's a nice heavy duty cable on one end you have a DC port and on the other end you can actually plug this into a uh, 12 volt battery you, you, as you can see these are, these are nice and thick um, I want to say heavy duty uh, battery uh, uh, alligator clips negative and positive and then you also get another extension cable I'd say about four or five feet long give or take and on this on this cable you have two DC ports you can see that one is smaller than the other you also get the stakes be, I think they I think these are called ground stakes I'm not sure what they call them be honest but basically you can actually uh, so that way when you unfold your solar panel and have it on the ground and the dirt and whatnot you can actually uh, you can secure the solar panel from if it's a windy day like today you have to excuse the winds it's a bit windy out here but you can actually um, install these onto the solar panel so the solar panel doesn't fall over and then uh, you know you start losing your electricity and whatnot so finally let me go ahead and show you what the solar panel actually uh, looks like when it's unfolded sorry when it's folded and when it's not folded so let's go ahead and do that now if i was gonna say the weight of the solar panel i'd say it's about 10 or 11 or 12 pounds i haven't actually weighed it to be honest but it's about it's about that weight size and then uh, what's really nice about it is that it has these two handles let me get stand this up you can see that it has uh, two strong handles that's built into the solar panel and this is like heavy duty stuff it's not some cheap material um, i'm not sure what this material is in orange and black but the material and the craftsmanship is very nice you can tell from the well-shaped stitching around the corners and the edges and all the way around this is a very nice well built heavy duty solar panel and then the size of it the size of the solar panel when it's folded when it's fully folded i'd say it's about about 22 to 24 inches long by approximately 10 to 12 inches deep and then let me go ahead and unfold it right now for you to show you guys what it looks like oh and by the way 
they do ship this awesome 100 watt solar panel in a very sturdy box actually came in this large Amazon box and it, it comes very well packed and intact honestly I'm very impressed as packaging for something so delicate as a solar panel is very important because you want to make sure that the company I mean you can tell that Go Labs really takes pride in their products I've, as I have purchased their uh, big power station which is a lithium power station and then they sent me this 100 watt solar panel for a review which I really appreciate but you can tell that this solar panel was actually there's like a hard cardboard on the bottom and that solar panel was in the middle and then this goes on top of the solar panel and all the accessories go on the side of this hard cardboard and this box is pretty strong so that way they they make sure that the customer is happy all the way before the sale and after the sale which is very nice to know coming from a customer's point of view. So I just, I just wanted to mention that before we go ahead and unfold and install the solar panel and do some solar tests. All right guys, so with the solar panel completely unfolded, it actually turns into four pieces. And check out the construction of the handles right on top. I just want to mention, I just want to show the great quality that GoLabs takes care of their products and their customers. Check out this, I mean, you can see that the two handles in the middle, that these are built in by the way, you can see that the screws are aligned perfectly. I mean, you can tell this is made from very good quality. And they are, this, this solar panel is very sturdy. And, this, and the handles, I mean, honestly, this, I believe this solar panel will last years and years to come. As I am heavily into solar, as you guys can tell from my YouTube channel. So basically, when you unfold it, it turns into four big pieces. An approximate size, I would say it's about, it's about four feet long. Uh, about three and a half to four feet long which is not very big for a hundred watt solar panel to be honest especially when you fully fold it and it turns into one quarter of its size what you're looking at right now and on the back here you can see that remember what I told you guys you can actually install this actually has like velcro uh, uh, like I guess you can call these like foot stands and these actually uh, they fold in but when they when they want to install it they actually fold out and there's four of them and actually this pouch is also a pop out stand as well to give it more stability so you have four of these guys and then right back here you can actually see most of the specs that the solar panel you can see that it's a go labs 100 watt solar panel charger model sf100 there's the solar cell it's a monocrystalline type of solar cells that are being used here the max power is 100 watts uh, USB 1 output is 5 volts at 2.4 amps. USB 2 output is 5 volts at 3 amps. I believe that's the orange USB A output uh, where the black one is USB 1. Then we have USB C output is 5 volts at 3 amps. And then the DC output is 18 volts at 5.56 amps. There's the manufacturer, then there's the their address and whatnot. They're based out of Texas. That's uh, I love, I, I absolutely love this panel. As as you guys know from my YouTube channel, I actually own several solar panels. Some are 50 watts and some are 100 watts. But honestly, this is one of my favorite. As you can tell, I mean, just check out the stitching on the bottom and all the way around the edges. I mean, it's it's perfect, honestly. And it's it's definitely a lightweight 100 watt folding solar panel. So you can actually practically take this anywhere and charge almost anything. I mean, you can charge any USB, USB-C device. You can charge many different power stations, including the GoLabs R300 power station, which I personally own as I have reviewed it on my YouTube channel. So enough said about the solar panel. So I'm going to go ahead and actually do some solar testing right now. And by the way, as a safety tip, never plug in a solar panel while it's open directly to the sun and to any type of power station or battery because you will have a spark and you can actually shock yourself so i actually closed the solar panel i actually folded it like this which that way the solar cells are not exposed to the sun i actually closed both ends plugged into my power station and then opened it if you do if you do the opposite you will probably shock yourself and you will get a spark and nobody wants to get shocked right because electricity is not a joke guys so as a safety tip please use that and of course always read your manual if you look at the screen you can barely make out what the numbers are because it's so it's so sunny out here and because uh, right now i'll show you guys what the sun actually looks actually it's a fairly clear sky today which is a good deal to test out solar panels and whatnot so i'm going to show you on my screen what kind of wattage we're getting at right now you can see that the ecoflow river pro is online that's what uh, excuse me the green line is on the bottom once you open that you can see that the output is one watt and the input you can see under solar a, a consistent 62 watts 
you can see that the battery temperature on the top left is 78 degrees in Fahrenheit. The battery capacity is at 85% as you can see in the middle of the battery uh, picture or icon. And at this rate, a charging at 62 watts in salt was using solar. You can see that on top of the battery that this power station it will be charged in just about 3 hours from now. And right now, as I showed you guys, it's about 2 p.m. right now. Uh, to be honest, uh, I have tested this the solar panel a few more times. Just a couple days ago, it was doing an easy 86 watts. And then when the sun is, when the sun is very strong, today's not the clearest day, but when the sun is very strong, you will I have seen it hit 95 watts, believe it or not, which is amazing for a portable uh, solar uh, solar panel. So you can tell these are. Uh, premium solar uh, crystal cells and uh, so I just want to show you guys here right now we're worried about the input which is 62 watts and as you can see for the past uh, two three minutes I'm getting a consistent 62 watts earlier about 12 o'clock or so I was getting a little over 80 watts so if you guys are looking for a great portable and handy 12 volt 100 watt solar panel honestly go labs is the way to go and I really appreciate them sending me this awesome 100 watt solar panel. So if you guys are interested to charge all of your electronics, whether it's their power station or, or different brands of power stations or your laptop or your cell phone or your tablet or many, many different electronics, honestly, and especially with the accessories that you get with this excellent power station. I mean, honestly, you can't go wrong. Honestly, I forgot the price of how much this goes on, but I will leave a link in the description. If you're interested in this awesome power station, I hope you guys made it this this uh, this far into the video. If you did, I really appreciate that. And if you are new here around my channel, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you are into product reviews and how to enhance your Amazon Fire Stick devices or any Am any other Amazon device. As long as streaming devices go and product reviews, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the bell icon and click on all notifications. That way you stay up to date. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. And if you guys own different types of solar panels, or different um, different uh, solar panels from Go Labs as well. Please, please go ahead and leave me a comment in the section below, and I will get back to you soon. And especially if you guys have any other questions or concerns, go ahead and let me know. And if you guys own one of these solar panels, honestly, they are great. And let me know your experiences as well. Other than that, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.